This is Mr. V. Welcome to this video on energy flow diagrams. Alright, so we have already looked at a fair few different forms of energy. And we've looked at a few different ways that these can uh, transfer from one object to another. But where exactly does all that energy go? Well, that's where energy flow diagrams come in. We can use them to show where the energy goes and what forms of energy we have. So I'll keep this note on the side and let's give it a start. Let's start with our barrels of oil and our coals and etc. etc. These all have chemical energy. We take that chemical energy and we burn it. So we turn this into fire, which is a form of heat or thermal energy. Now some of this heat is going to escape. This is going to go away. All right, so we, we have some heat loss. But some of this heat will then go into water which might turn into steam and that's still heat, it's, it's the heat of the water rather than the heat of our fire. The steam coming off the water then turns these turbines. So the heat turns into the kinetic energy of the turbines. And again, we find that some heat is lost when we do this. We have some heat loss. The turbine spinning then creates some electrical energy. Now, if you've ever been in one of these turbines, you'll find that there's a lot of sound there's a lot of heat, which again is just, just a, bit, a little bit of energy lost. The electrical energy we use to power, say, our devices. So the electrical energy that is provided by the grid charges some of our devices. So we have this movement of electrical energy from the turbines to our power points and ultimately our phones. So we still have electrical energy. This electrical energy has simply moved from one place to another. In this process some of this electrical energy is again lost as heat in the wires that transfer the, the energy from the power stations to our homes. Lastly, what we could call it lastly, we use our devices for a variety of reasons. So we've obviously got a bit of light, which is how we see our mobile phones. We've got some sound from the games that we play. <coughs> and all of this energy comes from the electrical energy that we got from the power lines, which are made from the spinning turbines, which are spinned by the heat from the steam from the water, which is heated by the flames that we created using the oil which had chemical energy. So this energy flow diagram that we've just created shows where the energy is transferred and transformed at every single stage. And that is how you draw an energy flow diagram. 